Hello guys and welcome to a new tutorial. Today I want to show you how to move and animate the skeletal mesh with Matini. For that just add any skeletal mesh you like. So I will add the lion. Just add it into your level and scale it up or down like you want it. So I will scale it up like a big giant here. Okay. Now you have to do a double click onto your skeletal mesh and under movement and under physics you have to choose the first interpolating. Because when you don't do that, it won't move in matinee. So choose physics, first interpolating. Now with the skeleton mask selected, go into Kismet, right click, new event, and then choose any event you like. I will choose the level loaded. And then another right click, new matinee, and connect the loaded visible with play. Then with the skeleton mask selected, double click onto matinee, and now you're in matinee. At the left window, you have to do a right click, add new skeletal mesh group, and then you have to type in any name you like. I will call it test. Okay. Now you have three tabs or let's say three tracks. Now you have to click onto the first track or the first tab. So test. And here you can find a group anim set. Here you have to click onto the green plus. Go into content browser and choose any animation you like. So here anim sets and I will choose the K anim human base mail. So add this to the group anim set. Just click onto this green little arrow. Okay, now we've added our anim set to the matinee sequence. Now we have to zoom out a little bit. You can do that with a scroll. And let's say we would put this to 8 seconds. So put the red and the green arrow to 8 seconds. Okay, now click onto your movement track and press return. So now we've added our first keyframe. Now let's say go to 4 seconds and move it, move your character to the front and press re return. Okay, now we've added the second key and now you see it moves forward. Okay, now we say let at 5 seconds he will turn around, press return and at 8 seconds he will move to the front like this here. Okay, let's see if it has worked, and yeah, it moves away. Okay, now we have added a movement sequence, so now he moves, but there are no animations. To add animations, just go to the anim track, press one return, so just press return, then here at the new sequence you can choose any animation you want, so I will choose the, the run rifle animation. Okay, but now we see this, it is it is just one second the animation but our but ours is eight seconds so we want this to be looping so click onto this little black arrow right click set looping and now it loops and now is it he runs to the front okay now he moves around Okay, now try it out. Close this. Close this. Build everything. And now try it out. Play from here. And now you can see it moves around. Here it turns. And then it moves down here. Now we can play around with this matinee settings that it looks much more realistic. But now you know the basics. So yeah, thank you for watching and until next time.